Good afternoon everybody. Sorry, I was in the middle of doing a video and some someone nearly went into the side of my car. My keys are out of the ignition, they're in the cup holder because I've just been cleaning my car before I came back on and started doing my video. I did try doing it a bit ago, but I started tripping over myself. So I just thought, you know, stuff that I'll delete and I'll try again in a bit. Um, but yeah, the weather is awful here. So I thought I'd talk about because I've watched it on someone's YouTube and I've been watching a lot about this couple and I, I thought, oh, you know what, I'm going to have my say because I was going to do a video and I just, because I'm at, not at home, I can't research it a bit better but what people are saying about this couple alright, so I'm talking about Meghan Markle and Prince Harry now when they first got together everybody was so happy for him and you know were very supportive of him even the media was supportive and stuff like that it's only when megan i don't like even saying her name because i don't like her anymore i know everyone's got the views and opinions and stuff like that so if you you know we're all allowed that but i don't like the way she's treated and disrespected the royal family and the lies that have come out of her mouth oh magically i never knew about the royal family i didn't even know who prince harry was well that's a big fat lie because when you were 13 was it you, the, the, there's a picture of you online of you stood outside buckingham palace with your arms in air and your legs you know like doing a starfish style so that's a lie so you, you know what I mean and now it's like she's so obsessed with Princess Diana she wants to be the next Princess Diana everything so this is where I've seen on another YouTuber and it, it just brought it to light and I'm like you know what she showed Princess Diana's interview and then uh, Meghan Markle's interview with Oprah Winfrey and she's basically mimicked Meghan has mimicked everything that Princess Diana has said why how the hell do you remember all that stuff i can't remember why i said about 10 minutes ago how does she remember i know she's an actress not good one at that but how the hell does she remember everything that she's got to research it gone over it several times to make harry think that the same things happened to her his mother is happening to her She's brought this on herself, Megan. I'm sorry, Megan. I don't like you. You've t you've tried to this. You know, you've come in. You've e people have even said that you're wanting to change the monarchy. It doesn't need changing. The only people that are allowed to do that are the king and the next king and queen or whatever else goes off in the royal family. I never used to be a follower of the royals until Princess Catherine, I think, joined. But, if you watch, right, if you watch Prince Harry's wedding day with Meghan, you can tell how awkward, he's probably scared and anxiety, because, you know, your wedding day is stressful, you know what I mean? Well, it shouldn't be, but it is panic. There's parts where you can see him pulling away from her, and from Meghan, and he, Meghan yanking his hand back, like, no, you're not, you're holding my hand. The way she looked at Princess Charlotte, now she was all nicey-nicey, looking at her friend's kids walking behind her, you know, when she was at front. But as soon as Princess Charlotte came, that were eight daggers, dirty looks, I've never seen. And now you pick up these little things about her, you know, like, you know why would a woman be so jealous of a kid? See, because she's not got a princess. Because I think, in my eyes, Meghan Markle wanted to be with Prince William because she wants to be Queen. And please, I hope to God she never... The world will go apart if she ever become Queen. And... Whoa, 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 whoa. Jeez, my car's right there. Well, people go a bit loopy when it's school time, don't they? Um, where were I? It winds me up as well, certain things that I see, and why, and then why, why she wanted to destroy Princess Catherine? Like, 
the Queen and Prince Harry and her made a thing it an agreement that she couldn't they could not profit off their titles and that's what it said and they agreed to that so why is Meghan Markle now in her um uh American whatever Riverara or whatever you want to say it business as she got the uh, the royal bit and if you look in the little like profile picture type thing or whatever it is that little symbol I put in there on her website it has HRH and she's not allowed to use that because she they, they sacrificed that when they wanted to leave the royal family so why are they still profiting off of this because in my eyes King Charles come on kick up the butt you need to get their titles removed because they've dished you long enough Meghan Markle Every time someone comes out about the royal family, she's out trying to get publicity in the car park. Like, look at me, I'm here, stuff the actual king and the princess. And they're saying that she's coming back to England in May with Harry. I don't think she will. She's crap scared of it. Because she knows for a fact, as soon as she steps foot in, this, in the UK, she's going to get booed. And she will not tolerate that. Yeah, and what's that word? She's a narcissist. Now, I I get it where they want to be, the kids, they want to have the private life. But Megan being Megan, she would, she'd be thriving off the thought of having her kids sort of plastered all over the news, and plastered here, plastered there, photographed here, photographed that, and she hasn't. In my eyes, yeah, I get Archie is real. You can, but Lily, but no, I don't. You never see him with them either. They're always gallivanting on holiday. I, I'm a parent. I've never managed to have a holiday on my own. Not once. I've had one day when the younger kids were, but that was when they were at the dad's. I was on my own, twiddling my fingers. You don't know what to do with yourself. These two gallivant all over the place. There's no way, if, even if you've got, uh, I don't know, it, I know it's going around that the surrogate, now I had a surrogate for my friend because she struggled to carry a baby and she would have been ashamed of having to use, you know, use someone to do that, so why is, <laughs> oh, I don't know, the, the moon bump popping as she was bending down, there's no way you can bend down with your legs cr uh, together like that. No way would your belly allow that because I'm. I mean, I've got a bit of a belly now, but and if I were to do that, my legs, your legs automatically open for room for your bump. Hers didn't. It popped, and then there was one where she. I'm just ranting now, and there's one where she came out with. She was going in somewhere with a purple dress, I think it was, with a bump, and then she went into there, and then when she came out, a bump. A moon bump pouring between her legs. There was no bump there. How the hell? I bet she. Even the picture itself looks awkward. <laughs> even the picture itself, you can see. Oh, it's like a look in her face. Like, and even Harry. If you look at Harry, his face is like crap. That should that should be up there, not down there. And her legs are saying it's like her legs look awkward because it looks like it's like trying to hold it. Hoping that the cameras are, didn't pick it up, but it did. Can you? Do you think they actually watch the news? Do you think? Obviously, there's no way I'd be able to cope with all this negative press. That'd do me over straight away. She thrives off it, and this vendetta she's got for Princess Catherine. There's no need for it. Yeah, you've you married into a royal. You married a royal. Does it really matter which one? <laughs> Why are you so jealous and nasty and bullying a, a three-year-old on your wedding day, Princess Charlotte? Because you could see it on her wedding day. How she, Harry tried to pull her arm away, his arm and away, should I say, and then she snatched it back. But the dagger she, she gave Charlotte was, oh, if I were that... I'd have died, if it were me, I'd have dived off and slapped her in the face. And you, can see, and you can see the Queen's not happy with her, with daggers that she were giving. And because, 
I know there was a bit of a thingy because she wanted a red carpet and because she was married once before, she wasn't allowed that. And she got offered the uh, navy one. But she wasn't happy with that. That's why she didn't have no carpet. Oh, I don't know. Let me know your point of view or whatever in the comment below. I'm going to have to go because the schools are coming out and I need to get ready to set off because... I don't like being parked on the main road on a school run. Usually I pick her up further down, but because of the weather, yeah. Mm. Anyway, guys, let me know. Do you like Meghan Markle? I'm not a fan of her. I don't like her. I think it's the way she's gone about it. This She's literally, I want privacy, and then done the opposite. Oh, I want all this publicity. I'm here, I'm doing this, I'm doing that. I'll do a proper video on it. I'm just having a bit of a rant because it just I was just watching someone's video and I thought, you know what? I need to let it out. Anyway, thanks again for watching guys and I'll catch up with you in the next video. And don't forget to hit that like button, the subscribe button and that notification bell. And I'll see you in the next video. See you later. Bye bye.